Hey guys, so do you remember that video I made about a month ago? It was about the security craft mod for Minecraft 1.16. In that video, I never did make a tutorial on how to download it. All I did was showcase it. So in today's video, I will show you how you can download that mod for yourself. So let's get started. So first, what you're going to need is, um, I would recommend download uh, downloading multi MC is completely free. You can um, find it right here. I'll put all the links in the description so you don't have to go hunting for them. So, multi MC, what it allows you to do is make separate instances of your Minecraft version. So, some of you I'm sure have found the dot Minecraft folder and you know the mods folder, all that stuff and all the mods get switched around and some of them do not work well this this helps so what you're gonna wanna do is download this one right here download 32 slash 64 bit you're gonna wanna download that but I've already got that but I will download it again just for the tutorial so right here um I've got multiples of them what you're gonna wanna do is download that and make sure it is extracted so it's gonna look like um, it's gonna look like it's been it's, it's a it's gonna be a zip file so these it has these little uh, things on them I don't know what it is but that means it's not extracted yet so you, you're gonna wanna click extract all and then right there so extract there we go and it should pop up this click that and go down to this multi mc.exe double click that and then it will have languages and all this stuff click your uh, click your language click next and then make sure you have java installed java w right here you will click that uh, how much ever memory you have i would recommend having like at least two because some of these mods they are a bit um, Min, uh, memory intensive. Here's all this stuff. You ain't got to worry about that. So finish. Now, here is the multi MC. This makes things very easy. So, add instance. Uh, here's your mod. So 1.16.5. This is the version you are going to want to download. Click OK. Right click it and click edit instance. And then over on the right side you will see all of these buttons right here click install forge and then make sure it is on the latest release and there you go that simple so now you are going to need and get the security craft mod right here go to curse 4 security craft right here uh, and make sure it is the latest version so last updated four days ago game version 1.16.5 click download there we go so click keep and then it will scan the file make sure there's no problems with it it will uh, once it's done there we go so we'll go to the downloads and find your security craft mod right here and then click copy or cut either one's fine now go back to your multi MC uh, yeah here it is uh, there we go right here make sure all this stuff has a, has a check mark by it that means everything's in good working order now you click install mods right here on the right side of the screen click add and now since you copied it do control V or however you copy and it will load into this file name bar right here. Click open. And then it will be loaded into the uh, loader mods uh, Dropbox right here. Now you can click launch. Okay, be back in just a second. So what you need to do, make sure that you have your mod right here and Forge installed. Now what you're going to want to do is just double click 
and it will download all the files from Mojang. It'll take a couple seconds and it should be getting started. If this is a uh, brand new instance, it will have to get all the files. If it's if it's uh, if you've already had this for a little while and used it, it won't take this long. Okay, guys. So as you can see right here, it is started up and com com uh, completed deep scan of the version. It will take just another second or so. And if it doesn't crash, that means you have done it all correctly. There we go. And it sh and if it pops up an error message, then that's bad. See? There we go. But it is all set. So security craft, we're good now. So what we're going to want to do is just make a normal world and make sure that the mod installed correctly. Alright, so we are loaded in the uh, Minecraft world. And if you have to, make sure that this is going to be a brand new instance, so you're going to have to change up all your settings again. Make this unlimited or whatever you like. Uh, so now, what we're going to have to do is, well, here it is. So here is all of the security craft mods I showcased a while back. And just to show you that they work, let's try out the sentry really quick. Uh, where did I put it? Or where do they have it? Um... Where are they at? Sentry, sentry. There we go. So, just to make sure that these things are, in fact, working. Uh, let's go hostile mobs. Um, how do we do this? Okay, I think the mods changed up a little bit. But, anyway, guys, I hope this tutorial uh, helped you guys. So, if it did, please be sure to like, subscribe and comment um, anything as far as mods or any games you would like to see. So I will see you in the next one. Bye guys!